So today in our ninth class mathematics, today in ninth class mathematics, in direct and inverse proportions, in chapter ten, in exercise ten point one, this is the eleventh one. The average age of consisting doctors and lawyers is forty. If the doctor's age is thirty five and the average age is thirty five and the lawyer's average age is fifty, find the ratio of number of doctors to the number of lawyers. So here. The doctor's average age is given, and the average age of lawyers is given. Okay, and also the average of both doctors and lawyers is given as forty. So, what do you mean by average? So, here the average age of doctors is thirty-five, which means we don't know how many doctors are there. Suppose if the total number of doctors are n. Okay, so for these n doctors, you have to write the ages: age of the first doctor, second doctor, third doctor, up to n doctors. Suppose n can be ten doctors or twenty doctors, any doctors. You have to write the ages by divided by total n. Okay, so here we take the number of doctors as n. So number of doctors you are taking as n, and here the average, the sum, the Total age of the doctors. We don't know the total age of the doctors. We'll take the total age of the doctors as x. Okay. Similarly, so here uh, the total age by n. What is the total age by n? That is x by n is given as thirty-five. We got one condition. Similarly, here we have to uh, find the. Here uh, it is given the average age of the lawyers is fifty. So we don't know the number of lawyers also. For the lawyers, let us take there are m lawyers. Okay, that is m people. That is one, two, three, four, five, up to uh, maybe fifty or whatever number we are taking m. Okay, so that is one, two, three, four, so on up to uh, m. So the total age of the lawyers. This is the total age of the lawyers we are taking as m, not the age of the individual, but all the m. If you sum it, it is m. Okay. Okay, uh, if you sum it, you are getting as sum y. The total number of lawyers is m. Total number of lawyers are m, and the total age of the lawyers as y. So that y by m, that is the total age by the number of lawyers, is given as fifty. Okay. Also, the average age of doctors and lawyers is forty. That is, doctors and lawyers means n plus m. What is the total age? That is x plus y is given as forty. So here we are getting three conditions. We will make use of these three conditions and we'll solve the problems. So write down. Let number of doctors is equal to n. Then number of lawyers is equal to n m. Then total Age of doctors is equal to x. Then can you see this? If I write here, huh. total age of lawyers is equal to y. Okay. So here, given I am erasing this. This is uh, for your understanding. I have done it rough. So given. By using the given condition, what you can write, x by n, that is the average age of the doctors is thirty-five. Doctors' average age, average age, x by n is equal to forty. Okay, then lawyers' average age. average age that is y by m is equal to 50 so from this you can write x is equal to cross multiply 40 into n can you see this 40 into n from this you can write y is equal to 50 into m and cross multiplying it so also what we can write we can write that x plus y Average age of doctors and lawyers by n plus m is given as forty. Okay, so here in place of x we got forty n plus in place of y we got as fifty m by 
n plus m is equal to 40. Okay, I am substituting these two values in this condition. In place of x and y, I am converting x and y into m and n. Cross multiply it. So, 40n plus 50m is equal to 40 into n plus m. That is 40n plus 40m. Okay, so this is 40n plus 50m. So, here you have 40n and also this is 40n. Bring it this side. So, 40n plus 40n is equal to this is 40m so this is given as uh, this is given as 40 and this is 50 so what you'll get 40n plus this is 80 40m minus 50m so this is 80n is equal to minus 10m minus 10 m you get. So, n by m is equal to, so I will get the answer as this is given as 35. What I have written? Doctor's average age is uh, 35. This is not 40. This is 35. I have done a mistake here. This is 35. This is 35. So, 35 n you will get. X is equal to this is 35 n. So here you get 35, here also 35, here also 35. So now 35n, bring it this side, minus 40, this is n, n is equal to, bring this, thirty five n bring it this side minus forty n is equal to forty m minus fifty m so this is minus five n is equal to minus ten m minus minus gets cancelled five ones are five twos are so that is n is equal to two m so n by m is equal to two by one so Ratio of number of doctors to number of lawyers. N is the number of doctors. M is the number of lawyers. So, ratio of number of doctors to ratio of number of doctors to number of lawyers. Number of lawyers is equal to 2 is to 1. This is the final answer. Like, subscribe and share my channel.